Hello! Welcome to our webinar. It is called Second Home in Alanya Given the New Reality. So if you are thinking about buying real estate in Alanya, uh, either for investment or uh, just to spend more time here, maybe you would like to relocate to this wonderful place, uh, this is the right place for you. We hope that it will uh, give you some useful information and some insights into the market today. So thank you for joining us. My name is Irina Irina, and I am the English voice of Tridvisor. Tridvisor is uh, the name of our real estate company and uh, it stands for Turkish Real Estate Advisor. However, we are a small company and for now, we specialize uh, really just in Alanya and uh, uh, its region. And this is our strengths, our advantage, because we know this market very well. We know Alanya, its districts very well. We know uh, the majority of developers and uh, a lot of residences and can uh, actually give you good advice with regards to pluses and minuses. And we can help you find uh, the apartment or villa or house or whatever you would like in Alanya that would meet your requirements um, at most. So we are a small but fully licensed company. And uh, we were among the first 10 companies which complied with uh, the uh, requirement, new requirement of the Turkish government and uh, uh, passed the uh, professional certification and got the full license in 2019. However, uh, Tradvisor as a company is uh, uh, has been in this business for three years. Uh, and our director, Ashan Yildirim, who you, whom you can see in the picture of our office, uh, he has about 10 years of experience. He's worked for international and Turkish real estate companies and is very knowledgeable. So today we are going to uh, address such uh, questions as why Alanya? What are the advantages of Alanya um, in this new reality? Because the wor world has changed, as you might have uh, noticed. Uh, we are going to talk about uh, the developing real estate market trends and opportunities. Uh, developing trends because the market is just uh, adjusting to the new reality. And of course, some things are changing. Um, we have some expectations, so we are happy to share our insights with you today. And uh, the last section would be our gems and special offers. Mm, gems, uh, uh, what we mean by that is that each crisis is also a good opportunity. So especially given the devaluation of, uh, of the Turkish lira and uh, uh, the lack of tourists right now, uh, we uh, can expect uh, that prices would go down. And always there are some owners uh, who need to sell urgently. So gems are some opportunities which are actually offered uh, uh, at the price below uh, the market uh, price, I would say. And special offers, given the new reality, some of the developers are actually going to offer some uh, special offers to you, and we are happy to share them with you too. So speaking about Alanya and its advantages in the era of uh, uh, COVID-19 challenge, um, first of all, Alanya is uh, a unique place, even in Turkey, because it really has endless beaches, which fit very well with the new social distancing requirements. The last couple of years were very successful for Alanya in terms of tourism. But even last year, when uh, we had a record high number of tourists visiting Alanya, because of the long kilometers the beaches are stretching for, there was always some part of the beach which was less crowded, 
Also, we have a lot of lovely bays, so it is always possible to find a place which uh, mm, will not be so crowded as some central parts of uh, the beach. Uh, Alanya really stretches uh, for uh, kilometers of beaches uh, which go from the center of it, the peninsula with the old, uh, uh, with the ancient fortress. Alanya is a very uh, comfortable town. It's a small town. The population is slightly more than 300,000. Uh, and uh, the infrastructure is uh, very developed. We have lots of uh, um, uh, stores. We have wonderful uh, transportation infrastructure, uh, health infrastructure. <laughs> and, you know, when this uh, quarantine started, uh, Actually, uh, we heard about uh, some uh, lines, queues in some of the stores uh, all over the world about some shortages, but such things uh, we can really hardly imagine in Alanya because, uh, for example, in the place where we live, uh, uh, we have five supermarkets so within the uh, radius of uh, uh, 50 meters. So it is very easy to find a place which would not be crowded, even in the times when there were um, thousands or millions of uh, tourists, uh, the uh, shops in Alanya were not really crowded and it was always possible to find the place uh, without crowds. So. Alanya also boasts of uh, a lot of natural wonders. So not only the beaches and the sea, but it is surrounded by the mountains, which uh, actually provide for this wonderful climate, very mild winters, and uh, uh, mostly uh, for the most part of the year, you have really very comfortable weather. Uh, we have parks, we have rivers, uh, just within the city, uh, we have uh, places where rivers go into the sea, and uh, rivers come from the mountains, so this water is always colder, so rivers also provide some freshness to the atmosphere in Alanya. Uh, friendliness to tourists, this is also very important. Uh, one out of 10 people permanently living in Alanya is a foreigner, because a lot of people um, just decided to relocate to Alanya and they spend either all the time here or visit Alanya for uh, several months, several times uh, a year, because this is such a lovely place. Uh, also, one of the advantages is the new health certification system, uh, which was offered by the Turkish government and which is taken very seriously in Alanya. Right now we can see how the uh, beaches are being prepared uh, for uh, the uh, opening, expected opening in June. Uh, hotels are being prepared. We have a lot of boutique hotels. Uh, we have uh, uh, practically each part of the beach, uh, it has uh, all the uh, facilities for your comfort and uh, it is well taken care of. Um, and right now the uh, the workers are uh, just getting ready for the opening of the season which uh, we all expect to happen in, in June. Uh, and Alanya has a, a good network of health institutions. Uh, we were lucky with uh, this COVID-19 uh, pandemic because, uh, you know, most of the cases they were in really large cities like Istanbul, Ankara, Izmir, and this is natural. In Speaking about uh, Alanya, we just had very, very few cases. You can probably count them using the fingers of uh, just your two hands. And for the last months, we did not have any case at all. Nonetheless, uh, the authorities are still taking this challenge um, very, very seriously. So despite of the fact that there were no new cases, um, uh, we still comply with all these disinfection requirements. Like you can see that the streets are being disinfected all the time, several times a day. <laughs> they are just washed with uh, 
some special detergent, uh, the uh, staircases, entrances of apartment houses, the areas uh, around the swimming pools uh, uh, close to apartment houses. It, it also, everything is being disinfected, uh, mask wearing, social distancing. We are very, very serious about it in Alanya. The masks are distributed, uh, and uh, if you if you need to use public transportation, uh, by the way, it, it was working all the time in Alanya. Uh, also, the mask is uh, mandatory. So we hope that, uh, given all these uh, preparations and measures, uh, the um, tourist season will open successfully and uh, uh, will continue successfully. This is also very very important and. Not only tourists, but uh, all people who come to Alanya, who live here, will who will uh, be the new residents of Alanya, uh, will enjoy uh, their time uh, there all the time, irrespective of uh, this new challenge. And I have heard from a number of our clients that actually Alanya was a really good place to spend uh, this quarantine and uh, uh, that, um, uh, well, you cannot say that, you know, we were all happy about this quarantine, but at least they were happy uh, to, to be here uh, during these very difficult days. Uh, Alanya is very close to Gazipasha, which is agricultural uh, region, one of the biggest agricultural producers exporting uh, everything to more than 30 countries uh, in the world. And so uh, if some countries experience some shortages of food, uh, some goods, toilet paper, whatever, here again, it was uh, really impossible even to, be, uh, to imagine because uh, uh, fresh fruit, fresh vegetables are available uh, all year round and they are still available. And uh, one of the, uh, consequences of this pandemic situation was only that actually prices in the market are lower now than they are usually at that time of the year because uh, uh, there are uh, less people buying all this wonderful uh, agricultural uh, produce. And uh, so uh, it would be uh, pretty um, honest to say, I think, that Alanya is a safer place than many others and well adjusted to the COVID-19 challenges. Uh, and uh, this is uh, very important uh, because unfortunately we see that not all countries are coping so well with this challenge and we hear uh, very uh, troubling messages from Spain, from Italy that they are not sure whether uh, they would be able to open the tourist season uh, this year. Um, however, due to this new approach uh, and uh, uh, readiness and new health certification system and other things, including the um, establishment of special uh, 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 booths that would uh, conduct uh, the COVID-19 test at the airports uh, uh, starting from the 1st of June, uh, all these things, uh, uh, they really give us uh, uh, not just hope, but uh, some sort of confidence that things will go well here. Uh, well, we talked about the advantages of Alanya uh, just in terms of the uh, COVID-19 challenge, but I would like also briefly to mention about some other advantages which have always been in place here. And um, uh, these are such advantages as uh, cheaper costs of quality uh, living than in um, practically all other countries with similar climate. Uh, look at Spain, uh, Greece, uh, um, Italy, Portugal, which are also quite popular uh, with tourists and uh, also with uh, people who are looking for uh, uh, just second holiday home. Uh, in a nice place uh, or who are looking for international retirement. Uh, 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 well, uh, prices are much cheaper in Alanya and also uh, uh, just uh, it is possible to uh, to purchase uh, a very decent apartment or house at a much cheaper price than in those countries. 
uh, visa free entry uh, for 60 or for the most uh, countries 90 days every 180 days so this is also very important you don't really have to care about it so last year uh, Turkey introduced uh, this visa free regime for the EU countries uh, OECD countries uh, and many others uh, so this is um, actually wonderful uh, this really boosted uh, uh, tourism uh, we believe and uh, it's also a very good uh, uh, sign we believe uh, I should also mention uh, very streamlined procedures uh, for purchasing property uh, for foreigners uh, although there are some new requirements uh, which were introduced last year including the mandatory evaluation of uh, uh, the purchased property uh, still uh, everything takes not more than two three days and uh, this is again a very big advantage compared to other countries and uh, uh, if we speak about um, uh, residence permit it is also very easy to get it uh, for all property owners it is uh, uh, we can say guaranteed in Alanya there have been no cases when uh, uh, it will be refused and uh, uh, you can uh, in Alanya you can get it for two years uh, uh, um, when you apply uh, for example in Istanbul it's not everywhere in Turkey like that in Istanbul uh, first time you get it just for uh, half a year in Alanya it is two years and then you can extend it and again just for two years uh, so uh, in this respect uh, this is all very very easy and uh, uh, very streamlined I would say and we support our clients so we provide all the support they need if they want to apply for a uh, residence permit also for many people uh, who uh, at this point uh, do not plan to spend uh, uh, you know uh, all their time here uh, even these uh, uh, requirements within the visa regime are uh, enough like if you can spend uh, uh, 100 uh, uh, in fact like 90 days each 180 days that means that you can spend half a year in Alanya without any any visa any residence permit anything so that is uh, uh, also important uh, also very uh, low uh, taxes when you purchase real estate you have to pay acquisition tax uh, and uh, currently it is uh, four percent of the price which is the official price of the apartment uh, which is in um, uh, your uh, property title and usually it is a little bit uh, smaller uh, than the uh, the market price um, so this is the acquisition tax again in many countries it is much higher and in addition to that people also have to be, to pay uh, the value added tax which is not the case in turkey now uh then there is annual property tax and in alanya it is uh, uh 0.2 percent per year again uh, it is just from the that amount which is in uh, your um, title so it is it is a very small amount for example uh, for our two room two bedroom apartment uh, we pay something like 180 liras uh, uh, for this tax uh, uh, which is uh, less than 30 euros uh, per year <laughs> so it is very reasonable I would say so I have covered some of the advantages of Alanya and I also would like to mention that uh, it is probably the warmest place in Turkey in winter and uh, it is known as the winter residence of Turkish uh, sultans and I understand why now among other advantages I would like to mention a easy and affordable uh, travel by plane Mm, inside the country inside Turkey it's very easy to get to Alanya from Istanbul from Ankara 
and uh, uh, also if you want to go somewhere else in Turkey it's very easy uh, you can keep traveling while uh, for example you can have your residence in Alanya uh, buses uh, uh, planes uh, it is uh, inside the, especially in Inside the country are very affordable. Uh, also, would like to mention high quality and reasonably priced medical care. There are a lot of medical institutions in Alanya, both governmental and uh, um, private. And uh, uh, there is a new direction of tourism, uh, health tourism, and Alanya is part of it. And last year, Turkey was in uh, top five countries in terms of health tourism. So. This is also something to think about. Uh, it's easy to get a bank loan or uh, an offer to pay by installments uh, from the developer if you are buying uh, your property at the construction uh, stage. Uh, we cooperate with several banks and uh, they help uh, our customers to get uh, loans very quickly and it's possible to get a loan in Turkish Liras or in Euros and uh, it takes, uh, normally it takes a little bit more than a week but uh, with the banks we cooperate with it just takes a couple of days and so the entire process of uh, purchasing the apartment, you remember I first mentioned two, three days and this is if without a loan, if there is a need to get a loan then it could be uh, a little bit longer, but still it takes usually less than uh, a week, so like five working days, uh, which is a very reasonable amount of time, I would say. And it's possible to get a loan for 50% of the price, uh, sometimes uh, even uh, for a larger amount, uh, like up to, we have cases, 75%. Uh, and uh, I will not really uh, go deeply into the process of it, but just would like to uh, you to know that it is possible and it is very easy. Um, so uh, this slide shows you the beauties of Alanya. Uh, we have everything here. We have uh, the sea, of course, wonderful beaches. We have waterfalls, canyons, uh, wonderful bays, uh, uh, wonderful nature, bananas, uh, palm trees, avocados just growing everywhere, flowers uh, blooming every, uh, well, th throughout the year. Uh, because, uh, speaking about roses, for example, there are uh, practically four seasons of roses in Alanya. February is the month of tulips, wonderful tulips. Um, and of course vegetable uh, uh, fresh vegetables and fruit uh, which are available uh, all the time. This is uh, one of the reasons why Alanya is so wonderful. And now I would like to talk about real estate uh, market trends and opportunities. So speaking about the trends, uh, as I mentioned to you, the market uh, is just adjusting to the new reality. And uh, here we would like to look at the demand side. Talking about the demand, uh, in Alanya and this is similar to what is happening in other countries as well uh, we can see that uh, it is natural that people are trying to escape from uh, uh, larger cities where there are millions of people um, to smaller towns and uh, it is one of the advantages of Alanya as well uh, in terms of housing uh, right now there is more interest and more private uh, types of housing. Well, of course, villas, uh, some, you know, boutique apartment houses. And in Alanya, uh, we have a wide variety of everything. We have large residences, uh, five-star hotels, uh, which consist of uh, numerous apartment blocks uh, and they have very well developed infrastructure but also quite a lot of people especially in the season and we have also small apartment uh, um, houses uh, uh, boutique residences uh, uh, which very often also have uh, uh, 
uh, a small garden and uh, uh, have uh, a swimming pool and maybe a gym, a sauna, so some very good infrastructure. But in, this infrastructure is not for hundreds of people, but just for maybe uh, eight or 10 or 15 apartments, uh, uh, which uh, are located in um, this boutique residence. So. Uh, this is also something to take into account because if this new reality is uh, forever or for a long time, it is better to somehow think about uh, how you would protect yourself and your your family better. Uh, so there is more interest, uh, we can observe it now, uh, to the areas which are not so densely populated, to uh, the uh, parts of Alanya where uh, you have uh, maybe low-rise boutique uh, residences. Uh, and also more and more people ask uh, uh, not so much about the closeness to the sea, but uh, they want uh, their uh, new house uh, or apartment be closer to, to nature. So maybe closer to the mountains. As I said, Alanya is surrounded by the mountains, so we, we have a good option or uh, especially um, uh, I would say that there is demand for some residences which have very good uh, and big territory, uh, big green area so that you can spend uh, uh, you know quite a lot of time there uh, which is a well protected disinfected place etc. Uh, in terms of supply uh, I have already mentioned a little bit uh, we have uh, uh, Practically everything in Alanya, uh, we have uh, mm, already uh, completed projects uh, from the developers. Uh, we have some projects at the stage of construction. Although now it is the time of crisis, it is the time of volatility of Turkish lira. So uh, there is a risk that you know some construction might not be finished on time. Therefore. Uh, before uh, committing yourself uh, to anything in uh, such a, a project at this type, a stage of development, I would really advise to, to learn uh, the uh, reliability history of uh, uh, this developer. Uh, because uh, if uh, this developer has a lot of projects and always finish them on time, etc., then there is a smaller risk that uh, you might wait for the completion of your apartment for a long time. But if uh, the developer is notorious for extending the delivery of the pro the deadline of the delivery of the project and unfortunately we also have such cases in Alanya then the risk is uh, pretty high so the insights into the situation are very important here and we have a lot of offers uh, uh, from the secondary market uh, and uh, uh, as I mentioned there are always some people who need to, to sell their properties uh, uh, urgently. So uh, because it is uh, uh, um, such an interesting time right now, there are some opportunities to find some real gems, as we call them, at very good price. And uh, we will share some of such opportunities with you. And as I already, uh, I already touched it upon a little bit, but some additional factors which are in place are the Turkish lira volatility and the um, economic crisis, uh, which uh, is happening right now. And it, it is a global economic crisis, uh, uh, not only in Turkey, but um, Turkey is hit by it as well. And uh, um, so under such conditions, you would expect that prices uh, on real estate should uh, go down a bit, I would say. Uh, it's an interesting situation. You all saw how uh, um, uh, shares, uh, stocks uh, were reducing in price dramatically, uh, practically overnight, right, at the stock exchange. but. Uh, real estate prices, they do not uh, change so quickly. And I would say that preparing for this webinar, we were in touch with uh, uh, the 
10 developers with whom we uh, communicate on a more or less regular basis and uh, just two out of ten they were um, ready to offer uh, some good discounts uh, the others are still reluctant to do that and therefore uh, well time will show what will be happening it will depend on the tourist season as well uh, because a lot of properties are purchased just for investment so that tourists can uh, those tourists who pref prefer to stay in uh, apartments self-catering apartments and we expect that uh, this year um, actually uh, demand uh, for such self-catering apartments will only grow because of the uh, COVID-19 challenge uh, uh, more people will, would be uh, avoiding large hotels and large crowds of people. Uh, so uh, um, that is also an important um, factor to, to consider, I would say. Um, so now I would like to, to show, uh, to share some uh, of our gems with you. Uh, gem number one is uh, from uh, a relatively new developer however no risk here because it is an already completed project everything was completed and all uh, permissions uh, uh, technical passports uh, permissions to actually utilize this uh, uh, residence uh, were issued uh, last year so it is uh, a residence in Kargajak. And we will just show you some examples in different parts of Alanya. We have a lot of other samples too. So if you're interested in something specific, you can let us know. And you can also just let us know that, oh, I would like something similar, but uh, such and such things are important to me. And we will try to find something that would be meeting your requirements and your budget. Uh, the best way. Uh, so uh, this area, Kargajak, is uh, closer uh, to Gazi Pasha. And it used to be a very, very green area uh, close to the mountains covered with the uh, pine tree forests. Uh, um, there is a famous five-star hotel on one of the uh, hills there uh, called Utopia. Very beautiful. Looks like a castle on a on a hill and uh, 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 for the most part just villas uh, uh, were there however this area became very uh, popular several years ago and a lot of developers got land plots and uh, there are a lot of new projects and closer to the sea um, the density of construction is uh, really huge uh, however, uh, where it is not so close to the sea and closer to all these villas, uh, 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 the density is not so huge. And this project is very interesting because it is already completed. It has wonderful quality of construction, which we checked. Uh, it has huge territory. There are only two small apartment blocks of uh, five floors each spacious apartments and uh, huge swimming pool, uh, garden, uh, sports grounds, playgrounds, uh, even tennis court. So uh, this is uh, all uh, this territory belongs to uh, this uh, residence. And it is close to the pine tree forest, which uh, is a wonderful place for uh, hiking, walking. The beach is 100, uh, 1,200 meters away, uh, but it's not so difficult to get there and to get to uh, the other parts of town because uh, uh, there is a good uh, connection by bus. And also a lot of people, uh, they just rent bicycles, uh, motor cars, uh, motorbikes, um, electric uh, um, bikes and uh, uh, it's uh, not a problem then to to reach any place you want uh, or it's possible to rent a car as well too. Uh, so this complex has full infrastructure for safety and comfort 
as I mentioned, special, uh, 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 there are spacious apartments there. Uh, what is good from uh, each apartment, uh, you have a very beautiful sea view. And uh, uh, the price is also uh, pretty comfortable. So one plus one, and there are different layouts. So I, I would say that uh, one plus one starts from uh, 60 uh, square meters. There are also larger apartments. Uh, two plus one starts from uh, 80 square meters, but there are also much larger, more than 100, 130 meters. And the price of one plus one starts from uh, now starts from forty seven thousand euros, and two plus one from uh, uh, almost seventy nine thousand euros, uh, which is a discounted price by uh, this developer. So this was Kargajak gem number one. Now gem number two, Sugazu. Uh, we. <laughs> actually visited this place uh, just a couple of days ago. It is a private construction. Um, you can call it a villa or a boutique house. Uh, the person is constructing it for uh, his family and uh, the quality of construction is perfect. Uh, this uh, part of Alanya is uh, right in the center of Alanya above this peninsula. Uh, closer to the mountains. And uh, this very area is about two kilometers away from the sea. And uh, uh, this house uh, is almost finished. Uh, it would be uh, fully delivered um, uh, in July. And uh, uh, there are one plus one and uh, two plus one uh, apartments there, and uh, some of them the owner is um, actually going to sell right now. Uh, they are very spacious, uh, uh, like 2 plus 1, for example, is 130 square meters, and 2 plus 1 has also a separate kitchen, which is uh, uh, pretty rare in, in Alanya. Uh, so, as it is still the stage of construction, for example, it is possible to to change it and, uh, for example, use it as uh, three plus one. Um, and the prices are pretty comfortable too. So one plus one starts from forty three thousand euros, and uh, two plus one uh, with separate kitchen from sixty five thousand uh, uh, euros. Uh, and also wonderful uh, sea view of uh, the entire uh, city of Alanya, the uh, peninsula with the uh, old castle and uh, uh, the sea, of course. So this is uh, uh, in Sugazi uh, district in the mountains, as I mentioned, two kilometers to the sea and uh, close to the uh pine tree forest as well in this area you do not uh you would not see a, a big apartment houses for the most part uh it is villas and these villas are pretty expensive so we were very uh pleasantly surprised when we heard the prices offered by this developer but uh he needs uh, apparently he needs some uh, funds and uh, therefore at this stage he uh, is offering such a big discount. After it is completed, uh, uh, apparently it will be uh, much more expensive. Now uh, is the time of some special offers. Uh, uh, as I mentioned, uh, we have a number of uh, uh, developers we cooperate with and this is a special offer from a very reputable uh, developer and uh, um, uh, this developer completed uh, more than 15 projects uh, in Alanya, in Belek uh, uh, and these are apartment houses, uh, hotels, five-star hotels, dormitories for uh, university students. Um, and uh, this is their new project in the part of Alanya, which is called Kestel. It 
This is a green part of Alanya, which is pretty rapidly developing right now. And this new residence will be just 150 meters uh, from the beach. And the beach is quite nice there too. Uh, this is just one apartment block. As you see, it is not uh, uh, a high rise, uh, uh, just, uh, I believe, six floors there. And uh, very spacious apartments with very interesting layouts. Uh, uh, for example, some one plus one uh, apartments. Uh, so this is apartment with one bedroom. In fact, uh, they are like apartments with two bedrooms because uh, there is master bedroom, which is one room, and the living room, which is really huge, it has uh, uh, kind of two levels, um, uh, but there is no floor between them. Uh, there is a special staircase which takes you to the special platform, and there, uh, there is, uh, in fact, um, a bed and uh, kind of a bedroom for, for guests or whatever. Uh, whoever. So uh, it, it is very interesting layout. If you are interested, we can uh, send you more information and pictures. Um, but uh, uh, also this developer was uh, among those who uh, offered uh, discounted prices. And uh, so for the apartment, which is so close to the sea, 59,000 euros for a, a pretty spacious one plus one is uh, uh, a quite good price. In addition to that, uh, this special offer includes 25% uh, down payment and uh, 20 months, uh, 24 months installment plan at 0% rate, uh, which is uh, quite good. Uh, and it is uh, offered by the developer. And the expected delivery of the project is July uh, 2021. So Kestel, uh, very close to the beach. And I'm not sure whether <laughs> it is so good to, to be uh, just next to the beach when the distance is just 50 meters or something like that, because, you, you know, there is some humidity uh, there. Uh, but uh, this distance of 100, 150 meters is very comfortable. Special offer number two, uh, which also includes installment plan and uh, uh, discounted prices, is in Mahmutlar uh, district. Uh, this uh, is uh, uh, a reputable developer. Uh, who's constructing this uh, residence, which will consist of one apartment block, uh, which is good, spacious apartments, 350 meters to the beach, full infrastructure like in the previous one as well. I mean, all swimming pools, uh, saunas, uh, Turkish bus, uh, uh, gym, whatever. Uh, and uh, uh, the interesting thing in this project is that uh, one plus ones uh, are uh, just regular uh, one bedroom apartments uh, with open kitchen, uh, but the price is good, just 39,000 uh, euros. However, two plus ones are very interesting because they have separate kitchen here and two bathrooms, very convenient layout. And for two plus ones, the price starts from uh, 76,000 euros. And uh, also like the previous um, offer 25% down payment plus 12 months installment plan. However, uh, well, it could be negotiated for a longer period installment plan as well. Just 12 months, it is a standard offer. Uh, I also would like to show you uh, something from the secondary market and uh, something which would be uh, very good uh, in terms of investment. Uh, such uh, apartments like this one, they have very high rental potential. Uh, so this one is in Oba, 
And Oba is one of the most popular and most comfortable parts of Alanya. Uh, with very well-developed transportation infrastructure, infrastructure of all sorts of supermarkets, uh, shopping malls, uh, everything is in Oba, including the new government hospital and the new building for the uh, Alanya municipality is actually being constructed in Oba and uh, the municipality will move there uh, next year. So this is a new boutique residence, uh, boutique meaning really small and uh, uh, it's just one apartment block uh, and I believe just 15 apartments in it or something like that five floors uh, however it has a swimming pool which is pretty large it has a gym it has a sauna it has a special platform on the roof for sun basin and from that platform you uh, can have a wonderful view of the vicinity of the park, of the sea. Uh, the distance to the sea is uh, 300 meters, not more. And uh, because of this well-developed infrastructure, it is one of the places where you are next to everything. So just uh, in the radius of uh, uh, something like 100 meters, you have five supermarkets there. And you have also access to two farmers markets, the one in Oba, which is happening on Mondays, and the one in Tosmur, which is uh, the neighboring district, and uh, the market is happening on uh, Thursdays. So it is a completely new uh, building. The construction was finished last year. And uh, uh, this one plus one apartment is already furnished. Uh, if you want to rent it, you can. Uh, you don't need to spend time actually looking for furniture, whatever. It is. It is ready, absolutely ready, for uh, uh, the tourists, for renters, and so fully furnished. Third floor, which is kind of the best floor, uh, not the first, not the last, uh, and the price is fifty-one thousand uh, euros. Uh, we actually posted for. Uh, 52,500, uh, but uh, this is our special discount uh, uh, and uh, uh, for uh, those who uh, participate in this workshop uh, for our clients, we offer it at the price of 51,000 euros. And this price includes everything. It includes all new furniture. It includes full package of white goods, uh, it includes uh, all curtains, uh, all small things which you need for your apartment, including even uh, um, uh, the uh, roulettes on uh, on the windows. Uh, by the way, this apartment has a very nice balcony, and uh, uh, it is possible to enter the balcony from both the living room and bedroom and sliding uh, French type of uh, windows or doors uh, uh, also provided. So that was our gem number three in Oba, especially for those who are looking at uh, apartments uh, which they would like to, to rent. And uh, well, our presentation would not be complete without uh, several offers of uh, more comfortable and more private housing such as villas. So this villa is uh, really uh, unique. It is in Castel, uh, a green uh, part of Alania, and uh, it is uh, three, uh, uh, there are three floors in this villa. It is huge and um, in fact, you can use it as two separate parts of the villa. So two uh, families, uh, or for example, you can live in one part and rent another part because it has a special um, entrance. So you can look at it as a three plus one, like three bedrooms and living room and separate kitchen and uh, two plus one. Uh, the, uh, uh, total air floor area is uh, uh, 
400 square uh, meters. And this villa is sold together with the land, uh, 560 square meters of land on which it stands. It already has uh, a private swimming pool also and some uh, territory around it, uh, garden. It also has a garage for, uh, for the car. Uh, the villa is fully furnished, uh, all white goods are there, very good furniture, um, and uh, Siemens white goods and uh, uh, Mitsubishi uh, air conditioners in every room. Uh, it is about uh, uh, 1.5 kilometers away from the beach but you have a wonderful uh, view of uh, the castle district and the uh, uh, entire Alanya there and, and uh, panoramic sea view, very beautiful. Uh, another option, uh, villas, and uh, this project belongs to one of the developers uh, from whom we already had an offer at the stage of uh, construction. But this project is fully completed, so it's not at the stage of construction, and it was delivered on time, uh, which uh, only uh, uh, proves that this developer is a reliable one. Uh, these villas are located in a so-called villa park. So it is a special area where uh, a number of villas uh, were constructed, uh, and uh, there is a huge uh, swimming pool. In fact, it's not one, it's uh, uh, three or five swimming pools, uh, which are uh, uh, for common use. And uh, there are also some private uh, small swimming pools, but uh, they are for private villas there. And uh, uh, this uh, villa, apartment uh we have four bedroom apartments and five bedroom apartments four bedroom is 170 square meters uh two level apartment fully furnished and the price is uh, just uh 125000 euros now uh these villas are uh, about 1 kilometer away from the sea uh, this villa park has its own private beach with all conveniences. It has a shuttle service to the beach as well as a shuttle service to the golf courses. And it is called Belek Golf Villas because Belek is a pretty famous area uh, in terms of golf. Uh, there are 27 golf courses and some of them were certified as uh, 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 best European golf courses. Um, uh, there. So if you are uh, interested in playing golf, if you're fond of playing golf, then uh, this uh, is an option to, to look at for you. Uh, so I, at this point, we would like to, to stop maybe presenting our gems and special offers and just uh, um, cover a little bit uh, more insights. Uh, speaking about additional costs, uh, actually this was based on the questions which we got from those people who signed up for the workshop uh, for our webinar. So additional costs, uh, when you see the price of the apartment, uh, including the uh, tax which you need to pay, some stamp duties, uh, you know, pictures that you need to get, etc. Uh, all additional costs at this point, they amount to not more than 5%. This is from our experience. Uh, and this includes all the taxes, as I said. Uh, speaking about maintenance costs, uh, maintenance uh, is uh, uh, pretty easy. And uh, we provide maintenance to apartments, uh, uh, which were bought through us. Um, and. Um, in Alanya, you just need to pay for, uh, because there is no heat and you need to pay for electricity and water. And uh, using the example of our two bedroom apartment, 
in the peak season when we are using ACs and uh, convector for heating, let's say that is uh, in January and February, uh, or in summer in August, uh, July, August when we are using ACs all the time, uh, the uh, the bill, our bill for, for electricity maximum bill is uh, 60, 70 euros. Uh, all the other months of the year, it is much lower. Uh, water is very expensive. Uh, sorry, very cheap. Water is very cheap. Uh, and uh, uh, speaking about uh, other things, uh, when you purchase an apartment in a residence uh, or a villa in a villa park, you want someone to take care of this residence. There is a swimming pool. It should be, you know, cleaned. Uh, uh, garden, it should be watered, uh, uh, something should be planted, etc., etc. So all this is included in so-called IDAT. This is the maintenance fee for whatever infrastructure you have in your apartment house. And also uh, this is uh, uh, for uh, the garbage to be removed from uh, the area of your residence, etc. Uh, so this I doubt, uh, it really depends on the infrastructure which you have. The more infrastructure you have, the higher is I doubt. So I would say that uh, uh, it varies from uh, something like uh, practically 10 euros uh, per, per month. Uh, where there is no infrastructure, so it is just removal of garbage and maybe some simple cleaning, uh, uh, to maybe uh, uh, 50 euros, 60 euros per month. It is where you have several swimming pools, uh, you have uh, um, uh, gym, you have uh, maybe a beauty parlor, uh, maybe a cinema, so you have a lot of facilities and they should be take, uh, taken care of. Um, so this is I doubt. Uh, now I also would like to reiterate that uh, to our clients who buy apartments through us, we provide all post-purchase uh, support and property management if they wish. So speaking about post-purchase support, uh, this is if you need uh, new furniture, if you want to replace something, if you want to refurbish, fix, whatever. Uh, you don't have to have any headache, you just call us and we help you with that. Uh, and uh, also there were some questions about investment, uh, return on investment. As I mentioned two previous years, we're pretty good for uh, Turkey and for Alanya in particular. And so speaking about our clients uh, to who we helped manage their apartments and including the uh, uh, rent of these apartments, uh, I mean, arranging for check-in, check-out, uh, cleaning up, fixing whatever was needed, uh, etc. Uh, so uh, uh, their uh, return on investment was between 8 and 12% which is pretty high, I should say. Uh, so Alanya is very popular, but if you're looking for an apartment specifically for investment, uh, then uh, you should look at some um, other factors which you would look at if you are looking for an apartment where you would like to, to basically live all the time. Because uh, in this case, uh, uh, closeness to the sea is more important uh, also uh, you know a lot of people want to be really in the whirlwind of uh, all events so uh, maybe if you live uh, uh, all the time uh, just next to some noisy restaurants etc you would not be so happy but people who come uh, just to spend their vacation they they like to be next to everything and I should also to mention in Alanya that uh, uh, at night it is very quiet everywhere because Turkish laws require that uh, all music, whatever, it should stop at uh, 11 or at midnight at most. And so 
uh, we are not speaking about some crazy, uh, noisy uh, places, but just uh, even uh, for a living, uh, you are speaking about you are thinking about uh, usually more comfortable uh, places uh, than uh, just those places which are for rent. Uh, so we help with uh, that, as I mentioned, uh, and uh, uh, we help with uh, taxes. Uh, um, uh, speaking of taxes, uh, most people who rent their apartments, they pay tax, who lease their apartments, they pay taxes in Turkey. However, some countries require that uh, uh, taxes should be paid on all uh, property that is owned by their residents. Uh, for example, in UK, I believe they require that uh, um, you should pay uh, tax in UK even for the property which you rent in Turkey. Although in other countries there is no such requirement because there are bilateral agreements with Turkey. But this is uh, these are all specific questions which we can discuss separately and uh, uh, on which you also need to get insights from your uh, local tax uh, uh, advisors. Uh, webinar, it was a pleasure for me to uh, share the information we have and uh, our insights and also the um, uh, special offers and gems which we have. Uh, we will be very happy to uh, assist you in the process of uh, uh, getting the second home in Alanya. Uh, so let us stay in touch.